Welcome to Sling and Arrows. Today we're going to talk about the Matthews image. Let's take a quick look at it. Let's face it, not everyone can shoot a 70 pound bow. Not everybody wants to shoot a 70 pound bow. Some people don't even want to shoot a 60 pound bow. For that very reason, Matthews came out with the image. This uses the same cam, the same switch weight mods um, as your Phase 4 or your V3X, whatever you might have. The only difference is a 70 pound, 75 pound switch weight mod is actually a 50 pound mod on this bow. The image has the bridge lock technology for the riser, so you can run your sight through the riser. You can also run your stabilizer through the riser. This is a bow for somebody that does not want to shoot 60 pounds. Like I said, the 50 pound max goes down to 40 pounds without ever touching the limb bolt. You can go down a little bit less than that by screwing out the limb bolts. This is a great shooting bow. Let's go over here and shoot it and see how it shoots. This uh, image is set on 28 inch draw. We just put it on the scale. It's drawing 51 pounds. So that's the 75 pound mod it pulls about 50 on the image. Um, the 60 pound mod would pull about 40. Um, so you can see they're kind of about three pound increments there. Um, so let's go ahead and shoot this one through the chrono. This is the 500 grain arrow coming up first. 28 inch draw. Nice, nice draw. I think I should start shooting 50 pounds. Two twenty-four, five hundred grain air. If that sounds slow to you, don't think in terms of a seventy-pound bow. This is a fifty-pound bow. So uh, just erase all the numbers you you think you know in your head, and think more in terms of a fifty-pound bow. Let's try the four hundred grain arrow. Really good draw cycle. This is a great bow for anybody who wants to shoot a little bit less. And 250, that's what I'm talking about. 250 on the 400 grain arrow out of the Matthews image. Don't write this bow off as a bow that's not for you. We've had a lot of people in the past ask for the V3X in lighter poundage. Um, you know, this could be a kid's bow, this could be a lady's bow, this could be somebody who has shoulder problems. This is a high quality bow, okay? This is for anyone who needs to shoot 50 pounds or less. This is a great shooting bow. Um, definitely come by and test drive this. This may be the bow for you right here, the Matthews image.